Okay, السلام عليكم شباب. اليوم uh, I want to show you how we can prepare a calculated questions. Calculated questions is a kind of random questions where actually you assign a variable rather than a constant number, a variable inside the equations, and this variable can be changed automatically by the model for certain number of periods. So you, you can change your variable into 50 or 100, uh, 100 variable. So in this case, <coughs> no matter how many students do you have in your class, each student will have different question. Okay, so uh, let's uh, let's uh, uh, see how can we uh, do that. So the name is a calculated questions. Right. So before we do that, let us see the uh, what the questions I want you to show. Uh, I, I want to solve. هذا السؤال مفروض ميكانيكس ويعني هو عبارة عن هدول جاك سيارة. وطبعا تعرف هذا الليفر هون وهي السيارة هون فهون هذه هيدروليك جاك شون ان ذا فيجر از فيلد وذ فلويد اوف دنسيتي 0.7 جرام بير كيوبيك سنتيمتر انسايد هير وات اي ونت طبعا هون على الليفر على الايد هاي قديش انا بدي فورس حتى ارفع السيارة لهون 1500 كيلو جرام سو يا سو 1500 ذيس از انذر فيرجن اني واي so uh, yeah, uh, so P2 is equal to P1, right? The pressures. Uh, this is the questions you solve in paper. In Moodle, in calculated questions, you cannot solve steps. You have to solve one equation. So we can make all this by one equation, as a matter of fact. And the F here is uh, is equal to the to the M1, which is D1 terbiya ala D2 terbiya fi 1500 multiplied by the ratio with the ra. 9.8. So this is this is a single solution question, right? So you have to write it in model like this. However, now what you can do, you need to change a variable or more than variables. Uh, actually, we have five variables here: uh, d1, d2, uh, weight of the car, and then we have the dirah the first two centi, the dirah the whole, which is two zero six thirteen, right? Two zero thirteen. You can change any of them, but you don't need to to change all five variables. You need only change one variable to uh, the number uh, will be changed here. So reasonable and, and let's see, be reasonable. So the sayarat, you know, the cars maybe an elf kilo, thirty-five kilo. So this is what I want to do. I want to change f from uh, you know maybe one thousand kilogram to three thousand kilogram and see how the f will be changed. Okay, so yes, how we do that? Let's do do it in model. We go to model now, and I have uh, hydraulic uh, two course, right? And it's, it's nice. I, I can actually use this example. So yeah. So what I do before I do the activity, make the quiz. Actually, I go to the uh, question bank and prepare the uh, the. Uh, the Prepare the question in my question bank. Now I and I do so many variables in matter of fact because it's it's, it's so good to have uh, so many uh, categories, right? Because you can choose any of these questions, right? You have here energy equations, head loss, multiple pipes, whatever. Okay. So where I want to add my uh, my uh... okay, I, I'm I'm not sure where where I'm gonna do it, but but okay, I'm gonna do it here. Okay. I'm just uh, right. Uh, yeah. Okay. It doesn't matter really where, where I should I should I should buy it. But anyway, I, I'm gonna do it here, right? So I'm gonna create a new question. This is the idea. So if you have like a pressure or chapter one, you can add it. Okay. But you know you have to create a new questions. You have uh, the calculated questions. They have this one, and there is three types basically: calculated, calculated multi-choice, and calculated simple. Right. Uh, this is the simplest one. This is the second simplest, and this is the calculated multi-choice. So you can actually, uh, you know, uh, the, 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 if you know this, you, you, it's it's be much easier to to, um, uh, to program all of these. Right. Uh, calculated symbol and calculated uh, students. Uh, they call them uh, last. Uh, you know, uh, single answer. 
yeah final answer question yes <laughs> that's what they call it so the calculated multi choice is actually it's a final answer but uh, the choices is also an equations wrong equations right so i'm gonna do this one calculated multi choice add right so you, you get the questions uh, so so you you, you can uh, you know you can see hydraulic jack or something hydraulic uh, hydraulic uh, yeah hydraulic uh, jack or something right uh, and then uh, I, I have right the question here you can actually you know uh, just do like this control C right go back here control V yeah, it's perfect. So, so you can do that here. If you need to import the uh, uh, the equations, what I want to do, uh, what is the magnitude of F is required to lift a car with a mass of 1,000 kilograms. So the, the mass is the variable, and let us say this is a W. W, when you, make, when you make a variable, then you just make it like this, W, and then you put it between two curly brackets, right? So this is now, it's a variable W everything else is the same right everything else is the same all right w perfect uh right and then we go like this we don't uh, see and uh, then this is one answer only that's what we do and then we write this equation so so now the uh, the force f equal uh you can write text in the uh in the answer window and then what you can you when you start the question it has to be when this the answer was with the curly brackets and equal so it's like a coding right so this is now you have to, to do this you have to do the curly bracket and equal and then you will have to write the equations we have brought to, together it's actually uh one one square it's the same over five square five square you know it's 25 okay five square is like this just like like all right you cannot try the uh the hat for square this is the only difference between it and excel you, you write the equation as you write it usually in excel with this exception the power is actually double star not a hat so one over that's why i want to write it uh five uh, square root uh, uh, squared uh, five you know five squared sorry five squared right and then you have to multiply by w w because it's a variable you will get to w then it's it's actually uh, case sensitive so w is uh, large w here large w good all of them right so then you have to multiply it by again uh, two ala thaman thirteen all right, and then measurable 9.81. Once we've done the equations, we have to close the brackets, and then you can see here is Newton. All right. Uh, what you should, what what we like to do is actually uh, I, I like to make it only one uh, digit, right? Decimal one digit, and the grade here it's a it's a correct answer, so it's 100, right? Now, this is a multiple choice one, and then you multiple choice two, you just have to copy and paste. Now you have to write a wrong equation, right? So what you do, for example, you make it one over five rather than one over five squared, for example. This is one thing. And then none, right? It's none here. And then you, you, you copy this and you go down here again. It is wrong. Answer, control V right and uh, what, what you do you go 5 over 1 25 over 1 for example all right so it's just 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 uh yeah okay sorry this is actually eight one right it doesn't matter here but here eight one yeah okay it doesn't matter because it's a strong answer right so none uh, I have two wrong answers. You can another uh, another wrong answer if you want. Control V, right? Uh, you can have uh, this is a 25, same one, right? Multiply by each one. And then uh, what you can do? Okay, you 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 forget this. So now you have four uh, four choices. 
and then you go okay you can have uh, two digits or one digits here it doesn't matter or zero digits right okay uh, anyway so save changes once you go to this page, it means that everything is right. Uh, the equations are correct and everything. So do not synchronize because you only need, this is what you call the wild card. This is the your variant, right? Now, W could be shared by many questions if you have um, many other questions with W. But usually we don't need it. So only one question, do not synchronize. And then you go to next page. Perfect. Now, this is um, uh, the default from uh, minimum 1. Uh, this is the wildcard we have. And this is minimum 1 to, to 10. This is the default. But I want it from 1,000, we said, to 3,000. Right. And of course, let's see 1,000 here. Okay. And the decimal places is 1. Now, uh, decimal places is 0 because I don't want uh, a uh the one uh, you know 1000.1 .1 or something so i need just 1000 1001 or whatever right and uniform it means uniform uniformly distributed right all right so actually they already calculated the, the force for me and uh this is for 9.4 right because it's so small so now i want to see it for alpha update the data sets here so it will be calculated for w1000 so this is, so F actually is 20 Newton for 1,000. We calculated for 1,500. So I go on 5,500 here. So, uh, sorry, uh, 500 and enter, right? And then it will be calculated for a wildcard 1,500. And I check the answer, 30.97, excellent. Everything is fine. The other answer, 156, 1,955, nine, three. So they are different. Perfect. Once we go here now, uh, we go into uh, uh, we we force generation of non shared values, non shared or all world cards if you have, but you have to to do this force generation. So you need to force generation with it, with the new range here. And now, how many students you have? For example, I have forty students. Let's say forty, and then we have to add. So what the what? The uh, computer uh, did for me, in a matter of fact, he made it at 40 sets of different W, right? You can display one, you can display the 40, in a matter of fact, if you like, right? You can see your answers, all of them. You know, W40, 2751, 1872, 2772, all of them has different answers, right? All of them. Perfect. You don't have to show all 40. I usually just just uh, you know make, to make sure things are right. Just maybe display five only five values, right? Everything is, is all nice. So you go preview here. This is your uh, your uh, your question. The Hadrick Jack uh, is required to lift a car with a mass of twenty six zero four kilograms. So he selected this number for me, right? Fill the correct just to check this. This is the answer. And because because this is also shuffle between these answers, right? And then we close the preview. If we go another one, then now it's as you can see, it's another another value here. Close preview. If you need another one, it has you know a, another value. So anyway, uh, each one has different answers. Of course, this answer is sixty one point one kilo in Newton. Perfect. That's it. Save changes, and we are all set with this uh with these questions now you go back into your course and you create the quiz and then you select the um the uh you you, you go and you select of course uh the questions uh you want right this is the questions actually you want because it's under this uh, this variable right so i hope uh uh so yes uh i hope uh you have enjoyed it if you have any questions just uh, see the youtube again thank you uh, very much for uh, all of you